145407 oh, plus. Going over bills and adding up expenses can be stressful. Oh. Ernie Bach monitors his spending closely. He's living on a fixed income. He's like so many, feeling the crunch of inflation. I mean, it's tough for people to live nowadays, let's face it. It is tough for people to live nowadays. His biggest headache now, auto insurance. He says his rates are through the roof. My question would be to every one of our legislators, why did my insurance go up from $340 for a six-month premium for the previous six months of this year, the first six months, to $1,454 for the last six months of the year? What in the hell caused that, and how am I expected to pay that? Ernie is 86, opinionated, and a man with an incredible life story from the Navy to a long career in politics. That's As city commissioner? Commissioner, city commissioner here in Largo. That, of course, was a long time ago. <laughs> Ernie is president of the Florida Silver-Haired Legislature and head of the Independent Party of Florida. He advocates for senior citizens. He says the rising cost of auto insurance is a big topic for those living the retired life. People, especially those on fixed incomes, they're not going to be able to afford any of this. What really has Ernie scratching his head about his premiums and the nearly 400% increase, he's never been in an accident or even got a speeding ticket. And with such a high premium, you would think he would have some fancy brand new ride. But that's just not the case. Believe it or not, that's a 23-year-old car or a 20-year-old car. Ernie says he's a General Motors man. He can't afford to buy anything new, but he loves this car nonetheless and believes the cost of insurance doesn't match the car. The insurance premiums that State Farm was looking for is actually the same amount of money that this car is will get, will get you at a dealer. So for one year premium, it's the value of the car. Ernie isn't too happy and he is letting legislators know he's taking his years of politicking and consumer advocacy to the state capitol. But he says he's been in the politics game for too long and that the insurance industry is a powerful lobbyist. It's hard to take on. It's the insurance industry. No, that's stiffing the public. That's what that's doing. Ernie says it's time for change. Seniors can't afford the skyrocketing rates. In Largo, Jeff Van Sant for Spectrum News.